Hello guys, who here, back with another video. This time around, kind of scratching the surface on a Never Winter. So if you've never heard about Winter, Winter, uh, Never Winter, it is a free-to-play MMO RPG. And it's on Steam as well if you want to get so It also has its own launcher and stuff like that, but you can play it on uh, Steam. You are limited a little bit, you're only having two character slots, but they do recommend you then making multiple accounts if you want to do so. Just saying that out loud on the thing here. So basically it's just, you're gonna play around with it. I don't know much about the game. I'm not like into depth of the end game and stuff like that, but we're just gonna play it a little bit. You guys can see that it is a, you know, uh, you know, pretty awesome game just, you know, because it's free to play and you can just try to check it out as well if you want to but you can link that or the link is to that is in the description as well it is still updated a little bit not too much uh but it's very uh, very cool i played it way back in the day it has a little bit of a different system you can see all these people are trying to defeat all these things this doesn't give you experience you don't get experience in this game you basically level up when you complete a dungeon so we are going to go into a dungeon right now getting through there and that you can do it with people you can play with other people as well you don't have to be solo at all but we are going to do it uh solo because you can do it solo as well i'm just gonna do this little ritual that you have to do uh, every day as well because i do play a little bit on the uh, for myself and then we are just going to play this and you can see now we do have a bunch of people here that wants to also uh, murder me but I'm not gonna let them as well. But it's a pretty, uh, pretty awesome, uh, you know, game. It has a lot of, uh, uh, I think it has a lot of in-game potential as well. Like I said, I haven't looked into it. I just kind of like leveling, I like the leveling system where you just, you know, play the game, you just defeat things, and, and you just move on. That is uh, pretty awesome. And um, the max level now is 20. It used to be uh, like 60 uh let's see where are we going here shouldn't we be going through this uh no all right let's see maybe that was just a distraction oh i used my power <laughs> all right let's just go this way then i guess it's this way then usually there isn't a thing that tells you where you are supposed to be going um i am a melee character you can play uh, a healer you can play all sorts of things as well and uh, and I'm just playing, you know, a, a, basically a berserker. Uh, I like to play the tanks in this game, uh, but right now it's not. There is an in-game shop you can, of course, can you can play uh, or you can, you know, dive into. Uh, I don't think it's much pay to win, but I don't know if it's how much it is, what it is in that sense, because I haven't checked out on that. Um, but at least you can play it for free, right? So it doesn't really matter too much. I uh, do have to use my thing here and kind of just destroy them, hopefully. Uh, yeah, that did at least something. That's good. Because <laughs> I was uh, I was out of my element there. Uh, and then there's like a bunch of stuff you can get and whatnot. I'm just going to use this on them. There we go. And this, there we go. Um, you can, of course, uh, have a companion. I have a healer companion. You can have different things. You can have different mounts. Um, I'm doing my stable. I also have a dragon. I also have a panther I can use if I wanted to. And there's just a bunch of depth to all of that. So we're gonna continue through here. Also, that can reset some of my abilities as well. And I'm also using like an AOE thing. That's why there is so much uh, attack stuff on it. I am level 11 and I can uh, then choose a specific, like either if I want it to be a, oh, um, let me hit the right button here. <laughs> if I want it to be a, uh, you know, a tank instead, but I tried the tank thing and I didn't really care for it. So I just stuck to uh, the damage thing that I, that I am now. Uh, and uh, you have, of course, your action points down here. That's when you, the more you attack, the more action points, and you can do like very uh, stronger attacks against things. And let's see if I can get this guy on the table here. <laughs> and we got him. Uh, nope, we didn't get him. <laughs> there we go. So it is a little clunky at times, but not not something crazy or anything like that. Uh, you can you can change around of the UI. I changed mine around. Uh, but you can co customize it, uh, not like completely, but very much like almost completely. 
Uh, there we go. Get all these guys. And of course, it's very much AoE. Uh, I feel like it's the AoE build so it does a lot more. And I also go Berserk. I uh, do more damage. And get them all here. Let's see if we can't. They like to hit my uh, my healer guy because he's uh, he's healing sometimes, and that's uh, not very nice because uh, he doesn't take very damage very nicely. Uh, all right, but he did heal me. Thank you very much. And just to go through the dungeon here, uh, and we'll see if we get to the boss at this. I don't know, remember how long this one is. Some of them are long. Some of them are not as long and sun is very different to uh, each one and then you when you complete a dungeon usually uh you get to level up that's what i was saying like you don't get experience for this so if you can skip something you should definitely skip it it's it's not skippable in the dungeons but out in the world is just more skippable as well oh yeah oh i remember this guy this guy is a strong boy so uh but we do have our uh, thing here so let's see if we can not let's do our four ability here and hit him very hard, hopefully. And this one. Oh. He froze us. See if we can't defeat him. He should have some any uh, some help, I think, I remember. Uh I think he gets help from somebody as well. So I'm kinda holding on to my AoE abilities. See if my guy is getting Oh yeah, there we go. There we go. Okay, we gotta get these. Gotta get these fellers. Uh let's go. Hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him. Oh, okay, I'm getting low here. I uh, remember him being very strong. And that that's not nice. That's not nice, did it, that dude? That's not very nice. I might have to use a potion here. So yeah, the, the companion is not super, uh, super amazing uh, at healing. <laughs> and we do have action points kind of stacking up. Oh, he healed me there. Nice, good, good, good. He's... I also get out of the things, of course. And there we go. I'm not an expert on the game at all. <laughs> but you can dodge and you can uh, find advantages and stuff like that. Okay, I gotta get out of that one. I think I'm doing alright, though. I'm doing alright. Okay, now we're gonna berserk. I should have used that a little bit before, but that's alright. Eh, we did it. I did it actually much better than I actually did it on <laughs> some of the other ones. Oh, there's still a guy over here. Okay. That was one guy that uh, kind of... Snug up on us. There we go. Powerful attack. And we did get our attack uh, back as well. Okay, so we're cool. And I don't know if that's... Uh... Oh, that was it. That was actually it. That was uh, the boss. Um, I can't remember if... Uh... Oh, uh, let me get out of here. Let's get out of here. Because these, you know, you can kill these if you want to. That's fine. But you won't get any experience for it. You will get it if you go to here. And I hope you guys can see it from my face. Yeah, I can see level 12 I get. I do get like uh, speed and this I can I can take one of these. And also I get a new breastplate, which is uh, better than the one I have. So I'm gonna complete that and that's gonna make me level up as well. And then it continues the uh, game. So now I can basically, oh, I can also increase my points, which I am going to do. I'm gonna just continue doing that. I just wanna be the very strongest of boys. And then uh, you can choose either these two as other abilities unlock further. And stuff like that but you can also respect but it costs you a lot of stuff but we're just going to continue we continue with the next quest um this guy's talking <laughs> this is gonna run away from him uh but yeah we do need to i have a sheet i have kind of put in points what i wanted to do so i but can't remember which one it was so i'm just gonna go ahead so that's why i'm skipping all of these just running away from them because they don't give experience they just level up so the cool thing about that is also you will never be over leveled or under leveled for being uh, you know playing it will just there is quest out in the the world that you have to defeat but it won't give you experience uh it'll just take you through it so you will always be the, the level that you should be in the in the zone um of course there you can get stuff from the different uh, enemies of still but uh it, it comes down to uh, this um let me see okay we got the tech i was about to say what the hell <laughs> there's a monsters right there uh, okay, so here we have to free the frozen. I was about to throne, but the frozen enemies here. Let's see if we can't find some. There is one over here. Frozen dwarf. Break the ice. Awesome, got him. 
All right. Um, and also the snail I got actually f is through the uh, just the campaign or whatever you can call it. And I'm trying to avoid uh, enemies as much as I can. Oh, I didn't. Okay. Oh, there's more here. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Uh. <laughs> Make sure that they don't hit my guy. Use this fire ability as well. And then also jump to this guy. And all the classes, of course, have different abilities and stuff like that, as you probably are used to from other games as well. Uh, but I'm trying to, as much as I can, to avoid things because uh, it doesn't matter if you do, you know, kill, if you do get aggro on some of it, but it's just... Um, I wish that with the experience would kind of work on different things as well. I'm just going to defeat these these guys here. Because uh, they're probably going to be aggroed anyway, so I'm just going to defeat them. But you can see they do drop some stuff. They do drop gold and stuff that you... And white pearls and stuff you probably need for all sorts of stuff. But uh, like I don't know much about that. Alright, so here we have to continue at the pace here. But I just wanted to show you guys this game. I hope you guys enjoyed it. It's like I said, in the description, you can find the link to it or find it just on Steam. Just search for Neverwinter and you guys will uh, find it. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, make sure you like and subscribe. It helps you out very much. It's super much appreciated. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.